All right, everybody. It's been a minute. Uh, Brian Rhodes here, December 7th, um, 9 o'clock my time, 8 o'clock Eastern, 7 o'clock Central. Um, I'm in Atlantic time. I'm down in uh, the Dominican Republic. We don't change time zones. So um, I know it's holiday month. Literally, everybody's you know focused on that. Um, I'm focused on that as well. Along with that, we're still focused on the opportunities that we're a part of. Um, still focused on, go ahead and mute all. Still focused on, um, obviously, daily earnings. That is exciting. I uh, had a buddy that just got started today with it as well. My buddy, uh, Joey on here, Joseph, got started in some crypto option today. Um, congratulations. Excited for you to, you know, with a minimum of 50 bucks, go ahead and do your first withdrawal. You'll love it. Um, remember power team in the remarks. I'll show you how that works too. And um, so I've been under the weather and least, I think I sound a little bit better. I still can't hear real good. Had major sinus problems I, all the way since I went to Las Vegas. I don't know what's out in Las Vegas, but everybody got sick that went to the Transact, uh, you know, soft launch event out there with about three to 4,000 people. And if you're interested in Transact Card, we have a Zoom in one hour with um, my leader, uh, my my good buddy, Nick Sorensen. He's going over that. And if you're watching us on a replay, just a recording, uh, just message whoever, myself, and I'll give you that recording to watch it as well. But it's going to be like an overview plus Q&A, more directly for our team. So I've uh, built a team over 1,100 people DBOs over 5,000 total people since May in that company. And it is United States only. It's not in any other country right now. Um, they will launch other countries later, but it's a, it's a debit card. Think of a banking card that you can share that's FDIC insured. And when someone swipes it, you get paid some change instead of the corporations. So it's kind of cool how that works and how they made that work. And working with the banks, um, we've officially um, 100% new bank, direct, not a new bank, but we skipped our third party provider for the banks. So um, it, it's it's really cool what's happening with that. So we're really excited about uh, what's going going to happen with Transact Card and everything about it. And um, yeah, so I mean, it's so it's a lot there, but as, as long as you just think about a debit card and when you share it and someone swipes it for daily daily things that they normally buy with it, you get paid. It, we're not changing anybody's spending habits. They're not buying supplements, um, cleaning products that they don't normally have to buy. So I thought that was, a, it's really cool. But if you're interested in that, um, I will definitely, I'm going to drop that in the, um, in the link down here below, or sorry, the chat down here below. So you can hop on. No pressure on it at all. You can be a customer for $25 one time ever for life, being a customer for that and check it out. See if you like it. You can also become a DBO. It's $4.95 and we're building teams around it, making some money with it. Um, and it's not crypto related, nothing to do with that. It's the United States banking, you know, so it's legit as it comes and um, really good guys out of Utah. So, but the overview is in the chat about Transact Card. So if you're, if you're interested in that, just copy that, get on it in, in one hour, well, 55 minutes. So that's that's just my little overview on Transact Card because I don't want to go too big into it because it is it is a good overview. So I don't want to, you know, go, go to it. You got to really check it out from a better view to really grasp it because it it's one of those things where you watch it and you're like, that is an absolute no brainer. These guys put this together, which they have, you almost, it's creating residual income without having the, uh, the, the process of having to constantly build something, you know, I mean, a lot of people have been using the same debit card for 10 years, 20 years, 30 years, or you're using the same credit cards, you know, this isn't a credit card. It's a debit card though. So um, but besides that, let's get in and talk about, um, let's go right into first with what we got going on with crypto option. Crypto option has a promo that is extended till next 
Friday. So I'm looking on the site. I want to see. Yeah, there it is on the site. All right, I'm just going to share the site with you guys. Um, so on the site, directly on the site, and make sure when you go to enroll to this, that you talk to the person that is enrolling you, because there's not a spot where you see who your enroller is. You know, so you got to make sure that the person signed you up before you go fund it. You make sure that they see you in the back office. So that's that's a plus. But this this deal where they call it the mega deal is, you know, I've had some people take advantage of this, especially the 10,000, because if you put 10,000 or above anywhere below, obviously 50 K, but 10,000 and above, you're looking at 1.75% per day on everything else below that it's 1.5% per day, seven days a week. These guys are showing us trades that are making way higher percentages than just paying us 1.7, 1.5%. But the mega deal that's, that's going to go until actually next Friday is 1.75 for 10,000 or 2% for 50 K 2.5% for hundred K and then the super, super mega deal delight. I love this thing. Sounds like going shopping at um, Costco or something, but um, this one is 500 K and that's 3% a day. So uh, these guys have shown so many cool trades that it, it's almost mind blowing what they're showing. And, you know, my take on it too, is we actually have, the, the CEO slash owner, there's no face to the company. Um, that's how do I say that? There's no like hired face to the company where they're like, yes, I'm your ha, whatever CMO, CFO, C who cares? You know, honestly, in my opinion, um, I just want to know actual person that, that created it and is working with it, not an admin behind the scenes that went and hired some other guy from Europe, Africa, or the United States to make it look even better. And then that guy literally has no clue what he's getting into. You know, I've seen that over and over and over um, since one company came out called Investable AI, where that guy was hired, uh, we found out, and he didn't have control of anything. Uh, the lead, the Lee. So he didn't have control of anything. Didn't know what was going on, you know. And when everything hit the fan, he's like, "I don't know what's going on," you know. And it's like, obviously, you don't. So that's the same thing that I'm, wa I'm watching that kind of trend. I'm watching other companies fund leaders, and they fund the leaders, and then after a month or two goes by, then the company disappears. Well, the leaders didn't lose money, but their teams did. So all in all all these companies right now, I, I just take a back seat and I'm just watching and watching and they're just disappearing. I get messages today. I got messages like dude wrote me out of nowhere. He's like, bro, these companies are crazy. They just keep disappearing left and right. You know? And I'm like, I know he's like everyone I got in besides crypto option has disappeared. Some aren't, you know, some might be still around, but they make tweaks and changes to where, you can't withdraw the same or you got to send in money to do withdrawals, which I don't trust that either. But with crypto option, you know, meeting Divindu and online met him. Uh, we talk, I talked to the guy every day. He was talking to me a couple hours ago and it's like two thirty, three 3 o'clock in the morning. So he's been fantastic support. He's helped people enroll when I'm not there to help them enroll. He's helped answer questions in our chats and everything. But if you're looking at this and you see kind of what's going on here, it's a simple process. It's a simple, simple website. You literally, there's a PDF to it. I can show that, but all in all, it's all right here. It, seven days a week, you're going to make 1.5%. And this is the only one I'm trusting right now. And uh, to be honest with you, I'm excited for Edge AI and I can't wait for Alan to get on and, and talk about it. Good night, honey. And, uh, because that one, obviously, it's going to be fantastic. We got a bot inside of a DeFi wallet that we can control the funds completely all the time. Crypto option, you are putting your funds in this to 5x. That's the next part here. After the 1.5% uh, seven days a week, the your package expires after it 5x's. So if you put $1,000 in, once you make 5000 
then you get your thousand back. And then, you know, you just made a total of 5,000 and got your thousand back. So it's almost like, you know, five, I call it five X, but they're like, you six X it. Yeah. But you know, that's my thousand dollars anyways. So, but your thousand dollars is being held for a while until, you know, you can make a thousand dollars off it. So if you put a thousand in this, you can't withdraw that thousand and, you know, you can withdraw the daily earnings, daily earnings, daily earnings, as long as it's a minimum of 50, you can see right here where it says minimum withdrawal 50 and the, you know, minimum uh, deposit is a hundred dollars in this and one package equals a hundred dollars, but you know, and I'm not putting this down. I'm just saying this one crypto option, like, 99% of them, you 95% of them probably, you put your money in and they hold it and trade with it. And then they give you a daily percentage until you get your money back. So um, I've been in this one long enough to make my original deposit back off of my original deposit. And then from there, you know, obviously I make commissions, but off my own deposit, I've actually made that back now, which was is great. So you know, looking forward to the next 4Xing of it is going to be cool. So it's a simple program. Minimum is $100. Withdrawal is 50 bucks. Uh, one package equals $100. And then when you share it, you can share it with two levels. I talked to Divindu. He said that they're doing really, really well, that now they're trying to make a compens compensation plan a little more lucrative but at the same time, very um, sustainable still because they're paying 10 and five. He's like, I want to make this go down six levels, but this won't happen for four to five more months. He's like, we want to make sure we keep the same pace. We want the private investors plus the passive investors to be happy. You know, when I talked to him about the private investors, he's like, we've been trading for groups of people that aren't online that have a lot of money for years. Then we put it online just to kind of build a community around it and to grow our accounts, you know, even faster. So it's not like they're trying to develop an ecosystem. They're not creating a, a coin. They're not creating a, an exchange. None of that bull crap. These guys just straight up get to the point and we're like, we're trading. This is the results. You can withdraw every single day as many times as you want, as long as you have over 50 bucks in there. So level one, 10%. 10% on anything your buddy puts in $1,000, you get paid 100 bucks. Um, you're in level two, your buddy enrolls someone for $1,000, they make 100 bucks, you make 50 bucks. That's, how, that's it. There's no level three, there's no level four, there's no level five. That's not attractive to some guys. And I understand, I've, I've been one of those people where I'm like, oh man, this ain't, you know, this is not attractive. I won't make, you know, tons and tons of money. Well, you actually can, you can grow your own account, you know, pretty, pretty well. And at the same time, you can grow with two levels and the sustainability of this is just surpassing everything else out there. And it's almost like, this is actually a really good no brainer, you know, alongside of what we're doing in, in edge AI is we can put $10,000 in, in the morning and withdraw it at night. So if we're making money here daily, we can withdraw it here, move it to our DeFi account in Edge AI and keep stacking that up as we go too. Mm -hmm. So with that, just going into the back office, it's got five tabs over here. And my referral right now isn't working because uh, I had a buddy had to get switched to me. Some uh, sponsorship mess up happened. So they're working on my, my referral thing. He's like, we're not sleeping until we fix it. So on the, on the profile page, when you get started, you're going to need to add your wallet address, like mine right here. I, I think you should be able to do it. If you can't, please let me know. Let people know in the uh, chats as well, our, our team chats. Let everybody know. So you're going to add the wallet address that you're going to fund with and receive with from the same address. Don't add your wallet address to re, re, um, withdraw with from like Coinbase and then fund with from Exodus. You're going to do the same thing. You're going to use a DeFi wallet. They won't let you even use a centralized exchange here. They are very strict in, on how this works. So if you're not getting it. 
reach out, we'll help you. Use a DeFi wallet like Trust Wallet, uh, Exodus. Those are my two favorites. Uh, MetaMask if you have to, but Trust Wallet and Exodus. Exodus honestly is the best because you can swap around there a lot easier. And you're going to put your, your Tron USD Tether TRC20 or TRX, whichever one that you see is your USDT. You're going to put that in here and that's what you're going to fund with and you're going to withdraw with. Then you got the compounding select uh, section. And on the compounding section, it's simple. It's what you've compounded in your account. And it's what, um, you know, what you've funded in your account. So like made a fund here of 7K, compounded 200, 100, 100, 100. If I want to compound again, I just click that and put the number of number of packages. One package equals $100, remember? So that's how this one works. I would just click submit and then that would compound it. So with that, also you got your wallet. Your wallet is what you've earned. And you can see I've made over 7,800 with this. I, I total deposit of 7,500. So I've made back what I've got started with. Super simple, super easy. I can click withdrawal, withdraw that 322. I can click deposit and deposit more. If I wanted to, I would just select here. I put the number of packages, say 10 packages equals $1,000. Put in the transaction ID here. And if you're on our team, power team, you just go in and write power team behind it and they speed up the process with yours. So it's been uh, super easy, super simple. Uh, Divindu is super helpful. Um, he's the owner, the CEO of it. The withdrawal function, I can show you I've done multiple five pages of withdrawals, not had any problems. Started this in September, way back when. I did my first withdrawal October uh, 10th. You can see it's 5,685 when I first did it. Um, but, you know, all in all, been averaging between 100 and 200 on all the withdrawals, some 400, some 500, 1,500, you know. My, my buddy uh, David that actually enrolled me to this put in a lot more. So his withdrawals, I think he does it every once a week. And one thing you do got to remember here is it's $4 per transaction. So every withdrawal you do takes $4 out and give them between eight and nine hours. Sometimes it's instantly when you do it when they're awake, um, but they are on the other side of the world. So right now they're sleeping. If you put a withdrawal in right now, probably won't see it until the morning. Um, but if what I've been doing is I've been just kind of saving my money up just a little bit here and there, a little bit longer, a couple days here and there, some days not, but, uh, and then withdrawing because it's a $4 fee, but minimum is 50 bucks. And all in all, it's super easy super they're super transparent um they trade they show you the trades um they do option trading swing trading day trading scalping and that's that's divindu right here super supportive uh, they have five traders from all over all over that trade for them expert traders and there's not much to this i mean this site is to me it's not complicated very easy um, there's, there's not much to it. Shows the, the deal going on, that Mega Delight deal, and a little bit more about the company. And, you know, the, the bullet points right here. Like, this is the easiest, simplest one I've ever seen. And it's been sustainable. It's made it through the rest, especially when you're putting your funds into something that is kind of is holding it, like I was saying. So definitely, um, if you're looking for a crypto multiplier, that is the one that I would suggest and that I keep suggesting to everybody when they ask me. I'm like, it still works. And you can't go wrong with 1.5% seven days a week. That's 45% a month. And these guys are showing us every day in, in the chats where, gosh, uh, what they do today. And today was, it was up here a little bit. Let me see, 12 point. 3.5%. They profited $1.3 million on their trades today. Um, yesterday, I think it was seven, 600 or 700,000, 649,000. And the day before, I think it was 2 million. Two, yeah, profited 2 million, 18.69%. So in Divindu, that's where he said, we're doing really well. We're going to look to enhance 
the compensation plan a little bit more, especially for those people that love sharing. So, you know, I've been in it since September and it was only two levels and I've been happy with it, you know, and then, so I don't know. Uh, I think Alan's on here. You on here, Alan? To, to go more into. I uh, am. I am. All right. All right cool. <clears throat> so I couldn't get, I couldn't get my screen flipped over. No, you're okay. Is, is, is Sally, are you on here? I don't see her anywhere. So I don't have much updates on AAC, honestly, besides I go in there and I do my five things per day where I just click on the different ads. Um, if anybody else is in AAC and they have any updates that I might not know about, you're, please unmute and let me know. But all in all, I see they have a contest. People are running for that contest and people are going to win some money and win some, some prizes with that. Um, but if you're in it, keep doing your five things because you don't want to lose your position in that ARP, like the cycle, how that thing works. So I think it's a really cool idea. I don't understand the complexity of all of it. You know, it's a little bit different than anything I've messed with before. And, you know, we were kind of told one thing and it's kind of done another, but at the same time, you can see it working it's not something that they pull the rug out underneath you. <laughs> so we're just kind of uh, excited to see it kind of work a little bit more and more people get the uh, ARP thing cycling over and over again. So, you know, with that, you know, Alan's on here. I don't want to, and uh, so we got, we got some cool things going on with Edge. Edge is the one that I'm just kind of sitting back telling everybody no. And just waiting for waiting for that thing. And Edge AI is that. You know, so like I've talked about Transact Card. I've been in that since May. I've been doing crypto options since September. You don't have to do either one of them. I don't, I don't care. It doesn't matter. Uh, the only thing if you're in the crypto space, you do have to look into Edge AI. If you don't, you're gonna miss probably the coolest opportunity in the DeFi space where you do have control of your money. You know, so Alan, what's going on, man? I know you're you're busy. You know, and uh, yeah, hey, Brian, how how you been? We've been good. We've been good. It's been it has been. We have been um, going nonstop. It seems like for the last couple of weeks with um, just I mean, it's just a whirlwind. But uh, yeah, I was going to give you a little, give everybody a little update, talk a little bit about uh, some things that have transpired um, over the last couple you know, a couple of days and over the last couple of weeks. Um, and then some things we've got coming on the table um, over the next couple of weeks before we launch everything in early January. So um, kind of kind of one of the I, let's start with some bad news first. Um, bad news. We had some folks um, that were cremate holders. So if you're not familiar with cremate, cremate is a token that we created with the idea of kind of um bringing out the ruggers and the and the guy the scammers in the d5 arena we kind of call them out we we you know and so that's we're, the idea is to cremate um, we had about eight or nine folks that are that were holders of ours um click some links that um were not i guess they're scammers and so they they thought they were getting an air an extra airdrop from us they people had uh sent them messages and they clicked the links and they they got a wallet drainer so we we had i think it was eight wallets um and so we just tell you uh, first of all we never ever ever need your wallet or we'll ask you to click a link to get pull anything because we have your wallets if you're with with us uh, i mean you, if you're especially or an nft holder so um, if you've noticed that the cremate token has come down a little bit in the last couple of days, that's because the guys who took all the cremate sold the cremate. So that's, I mean, we actually have more holders now than we did when we reached the top at 700,000. Um, we're on our way back up though. We're, I think we're about four or something now or a little over four or something now, um, which is still really strong. So I just want to let everybody know, because I don't think everybody realizes this, everybody that bought an NFT earlier, and you you were given a one and a half million cremates. So at the peak, that was about a thousand dollars that you had in your wallet um, that everybody got 
Um, so if you bought a $250 NFT, you had $1,000 in your wallet. Now it's about 650. I would not encourage you to sell it because we do have utility. And I'll talk about that in just a minute. Why you want to keep on, hang on to your cremate token, what the benefit is. I do want to let you know that there are two people sitting out there who we know the wallets, but we don't know who they are that we gave an Easter egg to and they got 15 million tokens. So they have about 10, they, at the point they had about 10 grand in their wallet. Um, it's about six grand right now. So um, we don't know who those actual individuals are. They are NFT holders. So if you haven't looked, you might want to look, you might have another Christmas present. Um, so there's that. And, and you can now look in Metamask. We got listed on CoinGecko. We've supplied, we've applied for coin market cap. They said they sent back a reply and said, Hey, we can do it right now, but you got to send us 10 grand. And I said, no, nah, we'll just stick with the regular process. I'm not going to send you 10 grand just to get a listing. Um, so, so we got that. So I, that's kind of the bad news. That's why if you look at cremate, it's gone down. That's why, because these guys that stole the tokens, they sold it. They don't, they have no value in it. Um, we will recover. Um, I, I know. So the cremate utility is, we will be coming out within about a week, week and a half is, is the plan is a raffle. It's a smart contract that you're able to buy raffles um, with using your cremate token. Those cremate tokens, a portion of them will go into a, a burn. So they'll be taken out of supply, which basically means there won't be exist, which should uh, we anticipate drive up the, the price of cremate uh, some more. Um, and then we will, you will win the first it, early, you're going to win ETH. So we'll send ETH to the winners. Um, as we grow and expand, we expect those, those prizes to be like gift cards, uh, maybe some computers, just different things. Um, so that, that's all starting here in about a week and a half, maybe two weeks. I, I, we're I, actually, we're supposed to have a meeting later tonight, um, about that, uh, with that dev team. So I should know more in the next day or two. So, so that's with the cremate. Um, I will answer any questions in a minute, but let me, let me go through my list of stuff here real quick. So the next thing we are, we have talked and discussed and kind of gone back and forth on the bot. Everybody know, I mean, I think most people know we have a dev, a dev fee in there of 2% on the front end and a half a percent on the back end. We're eliminating the back end tax. So there will be no back end tax at all. It's just going to be the front end. And why is that important? And why did we decide to do that? So you have control of your to, uh, in, uh, of your whole wallet. So if you put a thousand dollars in now, you can take a thousand dollars. You can take that thousand dollars out two minutes from now. You can do whatever you want with it. It's the same with the tokens. When the bot buys tokens, even though the bot is is going to be triggered and have a um, an exit price for you, if you chose not to sell it or if you moved those tokens out of your wallet, or if you decided to sell them while they're in your wallet, you can do that. There's nothing against that. Um, you can do it. It's your wallet. They're your tokens. Now, if you do exit the, uh, or move those tokens out of your wallet, obviously the bot's not going to be able to sell it because they don't have access to another wallet. They have the access to the wallet you gave permission to. So, um, we decided that because of that and just because it, it doesn't make a lot of sense economically in some in some cases, we decided to remove that. Um, so that, that's that's a development. Um, the other development, uh, um, oh, we when we do launch, um, one thing we are going to do, NFT holders are going to get one week at one week access before it goes public i mean before we start bringing on subscribers so um when it goes comes on nft holders will be the only ones able to use the ball anybody can watch you can see obviously the transactions are going to be public but we're going to just allow the nft holders for the first week after that first week if you want to use the bot you'll be able to come on so the nft holders you can be an nft holder now so you can buy an nft today they will be for sale up until the day we launch the bot. The only difference between now and before, the those that bought the NFT before October 31st did get cremate airdrop, and they did get an actually we actually sent out an extra NFT to them. 
so everybody has an extra NFT in their wallet. Um, but what we're going, what what's going to happen is, is say, say we go, we go uh, early January, we go public, we we go start launch. Though uh, one week from there, we will begin to take subscriptions. If you don't have an NFT, if you have an NFT, you get forty five days uncapped access. There is a subscription fee based based uh, on how we. Um, it's, that's how you get access to the bot. You pay a subscription fee. The first level is $199 a month. That gives you from $0 to $7,500 in trading volume. Let me explain how trading volume works. If you have a, if you put in a trade for $100 and you, let's say you set it at a 2X and you get, or and then it comes out at $200, that's a $300 trade volume. That's $300 towards your $7,500. We do not expect y'all to keep up with that. It's going to be in your off. It's going to be on the bot. You'll know how much trading volume you have every month on the bot. Okay. So, um, that, but when you hit that next trading volume, it'll, it, so you hit 7,500 on the 15th day of the month, it's going to have a pop up. You'll be able to sell regardless. If you're at 7,500 and you have a set, you have a, a, a token out there that hasn't sold, it will sell. You'll go over. You'll go over a little bit because it's going. It, it's going to execute all the trades, but but it won't. It will not buy anymore. And so, um, if it'll have a little pop up that'll say, "Would you like to upgrade your account?" The next level is 4.99. And, it, and, it, and you'll go to that next level. So it just, it continues. Every time it goes up, you'll have the opportunity to, to upgrade. If you choose not to upgrade, that's fine. You just will not trade anymore until the month is over. So it's real simple. Um, so that that's how that's going to work. So what the point is, the whole point of, go, of saying this is, you will, the subscription fees are paid when you sign up. They're not paid after the fact. I know there's some things out there that do that, but you, I mean, I, I've used this analogy several times is you don't get to use Microsoft Office for Microsoft. You don't get to use it for 30 days without paying for it first. Um, you've got to pay to use it. Unless you're an NFT holder, you're going to get 45 days of uncapped. So it doesn't matter if you trade $500 in trading volume or, you know, we 2 million is, you know, in trading volume. It's un, It doesn't matter. Um, it's all the it's all for the cost of the NFT. The NFT currently is for 0.25 ETH, and uh, if you, you know you, whoever brought you on here can talk to you about how to get onto there uh, with that. So, um, trying to think, um, we can talk about the specifics of the bot. I mean, we we are we we'll have the we're having we should have the UE. Um, Dim, we should be able to demo it next week. Start showing people. It won't be connected, but we'll be able to start showing, and therefore we will also be able to start doing some. We'll be start creating the training videos, and so we'll get those out. Um, nice, I like. You know, that. We've been, we've yeah. So you know, I'll, I'll open it up to questions. I think Yogi's on here. I know Craig's on here. Nadia's on here. We're all you know the four founders are on here. Um, I will just say. We have been, it's been very interesting. Uh, we've been on several AMAs. We we're on one on Tuesday. We had about 3,000 people on it. We were on yet one yesterday. They had about 500. We've got one. We're starting to do them all over the world. We've got one at, at 6 a.m., 5 a.m. Craig's time. We're doing one over in Europe um, that, that, I mean, you can come listen to. It's, it's posted in several different places. Um, we've got a lot of stuff lined up. Um, we're, I mean, we're pre. We, we did one earlier today. We are meeting with Certec tomorrow. Uh, we're ha we're having a meeting with Certec to start the process of getting Certec's uh, audit done, both on. Um, well, I mean, it's going to be done on the uh, the bot, and so they're going to have that'll take. We'll find out the timeline tomorrow, but I'm assuming it's going to take a little bit of time because they're going to have yeah, to go through all the code. Alan, let yeah. people know what Certec is, like what how oh. prestigious they are in that space. They are the largest um, smart contract crypto uh, auditing firm in the world. 
Um, what they do is they are a, a third party. We are also going to be doxxed by them. So that means we're going to show them all of our, our legal documents to prove who we are, and they're going to have access to it. If we ever scam, they, they can release that. Um, but what they do is they'll go through our bot, and they will examine the code. They try. They, there's six levels they try to DDS. I mean, they try to every way to hack it possible. They're going to look for back doors. They're going to do, you know, everything they can to try to basically blow it up. And then they're going to issue us a report. That report's going to say, hey, you've got this, 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 this that needs to be fixed or, hey, it's great. It's, you know, they're going to give us a report. We will have the opportunity to address any any of those issues. And, they're, you know, they have major, minor, you know, they have all sorts of different levels. So some of them may not be a big deal. They're more efficiency than they are malicious. They, they, they'll give us some suggestions. We will go back and, and, and make the changes. And then that and then we will release that report. So all that stuff's going to be transparent. We're going to put it on our website. Um, it's all, it'll be on their website too. So you don't have to trust what we post on ours. You can go to their website and see our report. Um, so it's a big deal. Um, not everybody does it because it is not the cheapest thing in the world. Um, it's, but it's something that I feel like we, we all, the, the founders feel like we need to do um, because the whole reason we created this was because we got tired of getting scammed. We wanted to create something that gives people the ability to control it themselves and have the opportunity to make money. And having a Certec is a part of that piece. Yeah. If I could say one thing too, um, any company that me and Alan have been a part of, uh, I mean, he hasn't been as obviously as part as many as I have, but from when me and Alan ever got into this whole crypto thing, um, they avoid Certec and aud doing audits like this. They just like almost pay some horrible third party provider that nobody's even heard of to say it's good. You know, so this is really big. Oh, I've even seen people take Certec. They will go pay for the Certec uh, audit and then they will, and then they change it. They do the Photoshopping and all that. And yeah. you go, okay, you go to the Certec website and it has don't, you know, don't do this. And you go back to the project website and it says, oh, this is a great, great, you know. So I, I will just tell you, it's going what what Certec posts is on their page and what we post on our page will be the exact same document. So that yeah. I can promise you. What one question? Um, maybe a lot of people on here I know is when should we roughly have a timeline? Is it going to be the beginning of January or towards the end of January or the middle of when we can get? It's going to be the early. It's going to be early January. Uh, we we. So here's here's kind of our thought process on this on giving a hard date. I know we've been asked and asked. Um, the we kind of got a little egg on our face by by launch by saying we were going to launch on the 28th, and then we decided, hey, with all the with all the hacks and security flaws, we wanted to put that extra layer of security. By us waiting, we've also decided, hey, let's go ahead and take the tax off. We you know it gives us time to do the audit before at least get it started, whether it's done by the time we launch, it's going to kind of depend on how long it takes Certec to do it. Um, and so um, right now we are very comfortable saying early January. Now, does that mean January the 2nd or does that mean January the 14th? I would just say it's going to be the first half of January. I'm, I'm comfortable saying that. I think that's where we're going to be as we get closer. I mean, I honestly, I think we all honestly believe um, it'll be done but well before then, but we're not going to launch over Christmas, between Christmas and New Year's. There's just no point. No, it's going to become redundant. We'll have to, we'll have to, you know, if we're going to do trainings and do Zooms and get people set up and all that, it's just, it's not, people, people are on holiday. People are on vacation. You know, it's Christmas. They're with family. So Nobody as much as we'd like anything. to get this done. Yeah, nobody wants to. Yeah, do nobody it. wants it's to. The second week, anyway. So, so I'm fine yeah. with. It. That's all. Awesome. So I would say the earliest. I will just say the earliest probable date is going to be January the second. So I mean that's the earliest possible date, but that is not necessarily the date we're saying. So just understand that. So, um, and, and dude, no, we're, you, we're not going to do it. You getting any sleep, man? You getting any sleep around there? Yogi sleeps in spurts. We I've come to believe. Like he takes a 30 minute nap here, a 30 yeah, minute nap there. I, I do. I, yeah, I do that. 
yeah i take naps throughout the day right keep yeah. going yeah it's good to see you guys i know you guys are working sleep when i die really hard, <laughs> really hard behind the scenes and um uh, we appreciate it you know i I've literally, I've been waiting. I've been waiting for this. So I've, I've been telling every company basically no, besides the ones that I was already in before, you know, I even heard about this. So I'm just waiting. So I'm, I'm excited, Yogi. We're, we're excited. We're really, really excited because this is going to give a lot of people a lot of freedom. You know, we've got a lot more coming out. It's not just this bot. We've got a whole roadmap. You know, and we're busy building that roadmap in the background as well as getting the Edge AI bot, the Ed bot done as well. So there's a there's so much work happening in the background, you know. And we're also dedicated, like everyone here, the founders. We're working all ridiculous hours of the night, day. You know, I think we're working literally, and we've got real life jobs as well, and businesses to run, and we're still fitting in time to just put in sixteen to eighteen hours a day. So it's a oh. lot of work. I mean, the crazy thing is, I think most people know I'm a school teacher. Um, but, I mean, I love what I do, so it doesn't matter. But I, 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 I'm like, I got a break. I'm gonna do this. I, I got a call. I'm gonna take my lunch so I can do this. I can do this call. Um, you know, hey, I'm gonna take my conference today. I, you know, I have. I'm very fortunate where I work. I, I've given a lot of a latitude. Uh, the people I work with, either they can't find anybody else to do my job, or they, I guess, they maybe like what I do, so they they give me some latitude. But um i mean we literally tomorrow so we're we're in, uh, i'm in central time yogi's this is like an app yogi's actually gonna get to have some real daytime calls tomorrow uh yeah. most of the time yeah, we're in the middle of night for him. but 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 uh this whole know, Craig's, Craig's, good. On, Craig's in mountain time so we're having a meeting at five he is five a.m his time so six a.m my time then we have one at seven and then i think we have one at nine thirty we have one at twelve thirty and then I don't know, I just make sure Brian and you and Sally know we have a leaders call at, at two o'clock my time. And then, uh, then we have nothing planned for Friday night. So I'm taking Friday night. I'm going to go have dinner with my wife. Um, but it's really the first night this week that I've, you know, even it's kind of been passing in the wind as, as, as we're trying, you're just busy and, and, and it's a good busy because we know that this is what it's going to take to get this thing up and running and, and get this, uh, the program. Um, I, I know people have also asked, I just want to address this. The people have asked about the, the, the links and the, the gene genealogy tree and everything. We're still going to use the Google, the Google forms for right now. We are, um, uh, we've, we're talking with getting the API and everything set up. Um, it's, it is being worked on. It will, that will come out. The back office software for the affiliate marketing will come out before the bot. That definitely will happen. Um, you know, we're thinking sometime before that might happen over the Christmas to New Year break. So although we may not launch the bot, then we may roll that out. Um, if you're in an affiliate market program, it's, they're pretty straightforward. They're not real. We're not getting real fancy with it. We're going to have um, the commission payout, the um, genealogy. So your tree, your, your tree and your referral link. That's going to be pretty basic. That we will develop it. It'll be ongoing development as we move forward. Oh, and we will have our website out, our new website out here in a couple of weeks. So um, we have actually had a chance to, to to play with it and look at it. It is pretty cool. I will just say that it's 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 a it's really sharp. So I think that's going to be really impressive. That'll come out probably about the same time as we're doing the demo on the the UEUI. So are you XUI? Sorry. So my advice for everybody was to keep saving your Ethereum, keep saving your Ethereum coins, stock up on that. And then like, like Alan said, you can go and get an NFT right now or what is it? Point. Um, it's 0.25 ETH. Um, so hmm. I'll go, I don't want to, we're not going to, I know we don't want to go through the whole roadmap, but I do want to just say, um, this the why what's what why the NFT? Why do you want an NFT? Well, one, it gives you 45 days uncapped access to the bot. It gives it to you uh, with no subscription fees. You're getting a month and a half without having to pay any, any additional subscription fee. You're getting it a week before everybody else. But a big part is is this is the first NFT of what will be a collection. So we are we will be issuing NFTs as we go. I know a lot of people don't like NFTs. 
that's okay. But let me just tell you what the benefit is of this NFT. We are we are going to create a blockchain. Um, down, I mean, we, we've already started discussing in discussions about that. If so, just like Uniswap has, uh, you know, or Binance has BSC, you know, Uniswap has Uni. A blockchain will have a token that they use to, and basically it's used to pay the gas. If you have all of the NFT collection, you're going to get an airdrop of our of our blockchain token. Okay, and so what happens is if you have that, so if we have 250 people buy the first our our, our night fright uh, NFT. And then the next, and then we have issue another NFT and we have 600 people buy it. And then we issue a third one and we have 5,000 people buy it, whatever. And we end up having six NFTs, let's say. And if you hold all six NFT, you're going to get a, a drop of, I don't know how many tokens we're going to do yet. You're going to get one token. You might get a million tokens. Who knows what that's going to be right now. If you don't have all those NFTs, you don't get that airdrop. So if you have it, if you don't have it, how are you going to get it? If you didn't, if you didn't drop, you're going to have to go to the secondary market and buy one. So what you pay 2.25 now, you might pay two for down the road. And I know several people have bought extras, uh, bought more than one. Um, some of you, if you have an NFT, um, if you had one before October 31st, every one of y'all have an extra one in your wallet right now. You can give that to somebody or hold it. Until we get all of them released, we issue the blockchain, which will be sometime in 2024. You can go out and sell it on the market. You, I, who knows what it'd be? It might be worth, it might only be worth 0.25. It might be worth 40. We don't know. You're going to be in the middle of a bull run. NFTs are going to come back in favor. And then you're going to have a purpose to own that NFT. There's a, there's a monetary benefit to it. So um, that's why the NFT is, is, if you don't, if you don't get it and you had the opportunity, I promise you, you're going to shoot yourself in the foot because it is going to bring you um, bit extra benefits other than just getting on the bot. Just, just like how people didn't buy the NFT before and never got the airdrop for cremate token, whoever got the airdrop for the cremate token is is uh, is a bit is a happy bunny, you know, because uh, they're two hundred and fifty dollars that they bought the NFT for before the 31st of October, you know, they've, they've made a, if they cashed out two days ago, they are a wide four X. Well, and I told them, you know, I don't know if you, I, you know, I told them there's two East, there's two Easter eggs out there. We don't know who they are yet. Yeah. Um, we know the wallet addresses, but we, we don't know who they are. They've got 15 million. So if they, even if they realized they had $6,000 still today, yeah, uh, but it was ten thousand dollars, and we and it, I, we definitely believe it's going to go back up. We just got to get this yeah. this Again, hacker guy out. Out. He's got a. I will say he's got a couple of million tokens left, and then he was done. I, I expect him to sell them here in the next day or two, probably, and then we'll be yeah. clean. Um, the crazy thing is, is we didn't renounce our contract until like a couple of days before it happened. If we hadn't renounced our contract, that's part of when you when you don't have an, a, a renounced contract, you can go in and blacklist people. That's one of the reasons people don't like it when you don't pronounce. But if we hadn't, we could have blacklisted that wallet. He'd never been, would have never been able to sell them. And so even though they stole them, which is still not good, he wouldn't have been able to sell them, which kills the, which doesn't kill the chart. It hurts the chart. Um, but that's just the way things happen. So, but yeah, definitely grab an NFT. If, if you, if you're, if you're interested, I mean, um, oh, one other thing I wanted to add. I just thought about it that we added. We are adding a, another level of the subscription. I know Sally asked about this the last time we were on a call. We are adding another level of a subscription, um, and it's going to be a $49 membership only. You will not be able to trade, but you can, you can receive um, passive income through the referral program. So it basically gives you a spot in the uh, the tree, and then you can go out and recruit people. And as as you recruit and and their their subscription fees, they pay subscription fees. You'll get a piece of that, just like you would if you were trading. If you have if you are paying the one ninety nine, that forty nine dollars is included in that, so you don't have to pay it on top of the one ninety nine. And it's a one time it's a one time fee. 
So that's, that's something I know Sally asked about, and I wanted to make sure and get that back to her. Yeah. But that will probably only get integrated once we go live on our platform. True. It's not it's not really available now, but it will be once uh, we get all the software up and running. Yeah, I wish I'd have bought some more cream, mate. <laughs> <laughs> I did say it on the Halloween well, launch party. I was like, guys, if you ain't bought some, buy some. <laughs> you know, even a hundred dollars worth. You know. So the crazy I, I'll tell you what the crazy thing is, is that, you know, and this is so anti DeFi, anti crypto today. We didn't take any. The founders did not take, we did not get, we did not drop any to us. This was for our community. We now own them because we bought from about a week ago. Um, but, um, and Sally's, uh, we didn't, we, so, you know, she's sharing the, yeah, you can, you can, that's the affiliate, uh, the affiliate plan. It's a unit level. Basically, level one is you 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 have one direct. Level two, you get two opens up if you get two directs. Level three opens up you've got three directs. Down to level eight. Um, level one is ten um, percent. So somebody pays the one ninety nine. You you recruit somebody or or sign somebody up, and they pay the one ninety nine a month subscription fee. Then you're going to get twenty bucks off of it. Um, if you if you have a level two, it's five, and then three. And then goes one one down to level eight, which is three. So, um, you know, we we just the number of people we've talked to, and the number of groups we talked to. We I think we're going to probably end up being in the five to ten thousand member uh, within the probably the first sixty to ninety days. Um, realistically, we are scaling the bot at launch to be able to hand, handle a hundred thousand simultaneous users but we've already got plans to increase that as soon as it launches to start working on going up to half a million um, just because we know what's coming. We know, we know some folks that we've, I know we know a lot of people are sitting on the side waiting. So let's see this thing work. We've talked to some, um, one of the like example, one of the calls we have tomorrow is with a, an institution. So we're starting to talk to some bigger players and individuals that are, are kind of coming to us saying, Hey, we want to talk. They're not obviously not going to do anything. But we're going to we're already starting to have conversations. So um, we're, we're working out how that's going to look. But this bot is going to. Um, it's, it's going to it's going to change things. I will just tell you this. Other, one other thing. There are two other bots. Are, so most of the bots out there now use Telegram. There are two other bots. We've already got we've already found we've already seen some other competitors um, that are going to do something similar. None of them have an affiliate program. So number one. Number, I know one of them hasn't released their their structure yet. The other one, you have to hold twenty five thousand dollars of their token before you can have access to their bot. Yeah, yeah. so it's 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 pricey. Yeah, so if you don't have twenty five thousand dollars of their token, you don't get their bot. Wow. All right, I like that. We're in a good spot, everybody. Mm -hmm. Watching this live, you're watching this on a replay. Yeah. Be ready, be prepared, get in those chats. Um, I think Sally dropped the chats and the info on there too. Um, thank you for sharing all those updates. I know it's top of the hour. Um, it, it, I have uh, one quick question, Brian, if you don't mind. Well, go ahead. Um, when the new website comes out, will we be able to pre-register and get a link or we just have to wait till launch? So um, yeah, so we are we are working on the software, um, the back office software as we speak. It will be released before the launch. My my, our gut is it'll be sometime between the Christmas and New Year timeframe uh, that week because we're not gonna we're not definitely not gonna launch. Uh, um, I don't know if you you heard Sally, but we're definitely not gonna launch before January second. That yes. I know for sure. We may launch on January the second, but we're not gonna launch over Christmas. It's just, it's no, there's, it's not, it's pointless to do that as much as we'd like to. Um, I just don't think it's a good time to do it, but we may, um, we will launch the back office software, which will have the links. We'll have the genealogy. It'll have everything set up for you. So until then continue to use the Google form. Um, I've already started taking the Google form and just working through the, the mechanics of um, setting up some, arrays and some different things so, so um 
uh, some old macros, if you're familiar with macros, um, to sort it and put it all in genealogical order by, by refer, by, or well, by promo code, by referral, by timestamp, date and timestamp. So it flows very easily. There's not any issues. Um, I will just tell people this, because people are asking, if you have an NFT, you can move it. That is okay. You don't have to keep it in that same wallet if you want to, if you wanted to change wallet. You just, that whatever wallet you use needs, needs to be the wallet you're going to trade in. You don't have to keep it in the wallet you originally bought it in now. You did to get the airdrop. Because if you did, if you didn't have it in there, we wouldn't know where, where to send it. Because that's how we looked at the wallet addresses. We looked at who owned the NFT. But now that that's passed, if you wanted to, oh, I don't like that wallet or I want to get rid of that wallet. I want to move it over to another one. You can do that. We're going to, we're, we will know when um, part of part of signing up and logging in is to connect your wallet. And then when you do that, it's going to see that you have an NFT in that wallet and it will give you access. You'll get in, get in that way. Thanks, Alan. Awesome. I'll be on tomorrow. I was just wanted to make sure so we can get our team kind of lined up and people can start working on their copy because yeah, we're anxious and excited. So that's good news. Appreciate all your guys' time today, Craig, Yogi, and Nadia. Awesome. Sorry I interrupted your closing there, Brian, but take it away. No, you're good. And uh, uh, we'll have some more Zooms uh, coming up before Christmas, obviously. And then, you know, obviously have a good New Year's if this is all the updates you need to stay informed and you're traveling be safe and just start stacking up your Ethereum and get those NFTs. So that way you're prepared. And you know what I mean? You just want to, you don't want to kick yourself in the butt, like Alan said. So um, thanks Alan. And thanks everybody for being on here. Uh, we'll, we'll go ahead and stop this recording now. If I don't know, that button is no longer here. I like how zoom changes on us. There you go.